Hello, everybody. Oh, well, that was a thing to install this camera, vertical, horizontal, vertical, horizontal, which is a thing. So I chose it ending being vertical. So this is what's going to be. It would be actually amazing for you to watch it through your cell phones. So I just want to share with you a nice alcohol ink. Today I'm going to use a different tool. I'm going to use uh, an airbrush machine. It's going to be a little bit noisy here and there. But it's okay. I'm going to try to speak a little bit louder. And I also going to use the blow dryer. I might keep it like very low as well. But just so you guys know that it's going to be a very noisy um, video. So I would suggest you to either try to listen to me or lower your volume. I have my alcohol 99% droppers ready over here. I have a bunch of them because I think I'm going to use a lot. Uh, I also have different colors. I have pink. I have sangria and I have pink sherbet, which is beautiful. Um, I have also monsoon, it's like a nice dark blue. And I have a little bit of gray and peach black. So again, all of my videos will start by thank you so much for being here. I decided to go live every Sunday at 12 and unfortunately I haven't figured out how I can make the video while I can see your comments but if you have any questions just leave it on the comment box and then when I finish this live video we are gonna resume and I'm going to uh, reply to you so I also have like some paper towel handy over here I have my Cara pot of gold and I have some um, India white ink. I don't know what's going to do it, what's going to happen to it, but hey, I'm into it. I also going to have my um, fluid acrylic in white. Just going to make it, I'm going to dilute it a little bit more with water. Right, I want to have that ready to do my mix. That's that there. All right, let's just begin. And I'm gonna start with, um, how about if I start with this soft color? I'm gonna have, I don't know, I'm gonna do something coming this way and then just breaking out this way. So I'm gonna start in here. I just gotta put my alcohol in there and then I'm just gonna drop my ink. And then I'm gonna come with my machine. All right, so what this is doing, the airbrush, it's just like moving and mixing the ink, which is nice. I'm gonna use a little bit of black, okay? And I'm gonna use my alcohol. I'm gonna put it over here. And then I'm gonna come with my machine. You can literally use your breath, you can do this. That's totally fine, but to me, I feel that I need to have my machine, otherwise I'm gonna be out of breath. I'm going to put a little bit of my blue. I'm going to open it over here. I'm going to have some of my pink. Right, so I'm going to move forward this way.
All right, so now I'm gonna mix a little bit of my gold. I'm gonna just put a very tiny bit, not so much. This one, I don't wanna to put too much gold in it. Just tiny bit, just at the bottom here and then here. Guys, I just wanna say thank you so much for all of your support. Um, I lost my most beloved little dog, Mocha, last Friday and it was a sad moment for us. I couldn't go live last Sunday. Apologies for that. Uh, but I do appreciate all of your support. Also, I am on day seven of smoking free. I quit smoking. I started to eat healthier and I also make a video about it. If you guys want to see it, I'm going to leave uh, the link on my um, description below so that way you guys can find it. It's pretty inspiring. I just document everything that I did while I was going through my nicotine cravings. So yeah, thank you so much for your support. Let's keep working on this. So I think I'm going to use a little bit of my blue coming up here. So I'm going to put it in here and then in here. And then I'm going to put my alcohol coming this way and then this one here. And I'm going to start mixing. I have to turn this on for it to mix. And I wish just move it around. It's pretty much very random. I don't have a pattern. I don't know what's going to come out from it, but I love how it mixed together and it's a pretty, pretty mix of colors in here. Okay. Use a little bit more of my velvet here. I literally just randomly moving my airbrush. I think it's just giving the the ink some help on movement, right? Till it creates something pretty abstract and beautiful. All right, that's very pretty. I'm gonna put a little bit of my sangria over here. Me like this. That's pretty and sexy. If you are new to my channel, welcome, welcome. I love to create paintings with different mediums. This couple of weeks I have been focused with alcohol inks. And it has been pretty, pretty cool and interesting. So, just moving things around like this. Okay, trying to dry that ink before I move forward. All right, so now I'm gonna come, I'm gonna keep moving over here and then I'm gonna go down this way. So I'm not sure um, how's it gonna go, but I am on it. So I'm gonna put more of my ink in here. I'm gonna mix it with a little bit of my sangria and I'm gonna blow it. Just moving it around the lane, letting the ink do the magic, but you still want to give a little bit of air to have some movement in it. 
away and here we come and she's could try them over here get a little bit of my blue because I want more blue in here. There. That's beautiful. And now I'm going to soft this area over here with alcohol. I'm going to push it that way. A little bit out and then a little bit in. Just creating that watercolor wash by going soft all the way in so that way you don't get these lines that you see over here. Not a fan of those. Okay. I just keep playing around it till you get uh, the desired look. So I got these. Um, air pump from Amazon. I'm going to leave the link under. So in case you guys want to try with this. I first normally bought it for to do my nails, to do like an ombre. <laughs> I never ending using it. So I'm using it for this, which is nice. All right, so far I'm loving it. Now, now I'm thinking, which way should I go from here? Should I still go all the way up in here? Or maybe I go this way. Yeah, I go totally that way. All right, so I'm gonna use my base, which is new. So I'm gonna come up here. I'm gonna get a little bit of this one here, a little bit of that. Out of my blue, I'm gonna get some of my gold. Not too much, just a little bit. Don't make a mess, G. Don't make a mess. All right, here we go. So, I'm gonna put a lot of alcohol all around it so that way I can move my ink nicely. And if I want, I just want to do a little bit like that. Let's go. And again, just moving the ink around. I don't know what's going to give me. And again, you can fix it later, adding more uh, of your alcohol. So it's totally fine. I want it to have some movement. That's pretty. All right, so I will do the same. It just looks so pretty. I love this combo. Combo colors are uh, very pretty. I'm going to use a little bit more of alcohol this way. I'm going to move it taller just to clean around those gold area. And I'm going to do the same over here. Okay. So I'm going to keep moving my inks over here just to soften it. A little bit more. And let's look here. There we go. I'm still a little bit sad, guys. Sorry if I'm not talking much. Um, not feeling too good, but painting makes me feel better. It's just don't have the strength to talk and tell you stories how I like to talk. Oh, that looks so good. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna actually this way, this way, and then I'm gonna finish going that way. So I think that's gonna look awesome. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna put a lot of alcohol just to go fasten through. I'm 
blue in here. I hope you find this video inspiring and you can hear me because it's very loud with the machine. <laughs> but I think the machine alone give uh, I don't like this little belts in here, so I'm just gonna clean that a little bit here and put more of that. It's just gonna move it around. There we go. Mm -hmm. right, while it dries, we wanna move it around so that way we can have different cool effect. Look at that, that looks awesome. So I'm going to get a little bit of my alcohol in the mirror here and we'll move things inside. I'll get a little bit more of this one here. And I'm going to move inside it's just to clean it up. Clean up, clean up. I'm going to go a little bit up. Cool. Right, so I'm just going to put a little bit of pink over here. Alright, so now I'm gonna put this. I'm gonna let that do its thing. I'm gonna let it do its thing. Oh my god, I can't even talk. I'm gonna try a little bit more. It's just moving around me so we get like cool effects. like a storm. We're just doing circles. So I want to soft this area here a tiny bit more. So now I'm going to use my big gun quick in here. Sorry, it's very 
now. Put a little bit of my soft pink down here. Yeah. And then use my machine. Just to have a little bit of a touch in here. Same over here. Finish up here with a little bit of blue. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna put nice blue in here in this corner here. Okay, so it's gonna go this way. I'm loving it, honestly, it's looking so pretty. I just put my alcohol and then I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put a little bit of gold on this one up here. Just a tiny bit, just in case. And then I'm going to come and finish that this way. I might need a little bit more of alcohol. Because I want to finish it coming off the canvas. Honestly guys, alcohol ink is beautiful medium to work with. Like, I love it. Okay, I'm just gonna clean this over here because it gave me weird lines that I don't want. I'm gonna soften it. So pretty guys, wait that I put it outside. Um on the easel you guys wanna see it better. Okay, so I'm just gonna get a little bit of my alcohol in here. I'm just gonna clean whatever drop in here. So maybe I go with a little bit of my pink here. It's a tiny bit. And just and click a bit here. Very quick, very quick, very quick. And again, once I seal this with uh, ink, um, with my fixative, this one here, I can work with acrylics after and do, you know, like some cleanups here with um, white. It's all about all the small little details that we can add on. I think it's cool. Okay, I want this blue to come a little bit more down. Just a little bit, not much. There it goes. 
just a tiny bit. Just off the chart over here. And I'm going to just make some of my pink and moving those lines that I don't like. bit of black here, just a tiny bit. My pink is very diluted with alcohol, so it's not so strong and I love that. big guy out So I'm gonna put it on my easel. And let's see what she looks like. But first, I'm gonna make sure that you guys can see what I'm doing. All right, first, I'm gonna flip this. Hi, it's me. right in here so you guys can see the piece. All right, I think she is beautiful. Can you guys see? Yeah. She's gonna finish drying. So this is what she looks like. I hope you guys can see okay. She's very pretty. And what I'm gonna do um, later on this week, because I'm making different ones, like this one over here has a different frame and I have so many more down here. So all of these ones are gonna be um, on display on one of, um, one of my coffee places, uh, coffee stores that I like to um, have my painting display on. And yeah, I think this is very cute. And she is not quite done yet because I want to add a little bit more of details. Like I might add a little bit more of like gold and stuff, but I love the softness. Like see this one over here? It is soft, but it's, it has like different color and it's like more strong than this soft color palette over here. Like I love this so much. So yes, guys, thank you so much for watching. And hi, thank you so much. Irfan, sorry I missed your test. I wasn't even looking. <laughs> 
anyways um yeah i had to get better with my filming uh especially i'm doing all this with my phone i do have a camera um but the problem is like my computer this camera is amazing is the v set sony i love it but i have a problem and the problem is that my laptop so I need to find something where I can put all of my videos into a computer and then from the computer, I can just, you know, edit and do my thing. So right now I'm doing everything to my cell phone, which is fine. So I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna let this completely dry. I'm gonna use my fixative, okay? Because this is gonna seal the colors before I use a, um, acrylics. Like for example, this one here, she is not done yet. I still have to work more, but I, as you can see, I add the acrylics on. But before I do that, I need to use my fixity. This is very important. You can find this at Walmart, Michaels, um, any art supplies. Not all of them actually have it, to be honest. So that is that and then i also have this one here this is one of my favorite like look at how beautiful this baby is look at the colors isn't this magical yeah it's very pretty it's very easy to make guys i look at all the texture with the gold is phenomenal it's a very very great piece I'm gonna work on a small pieces on next Sunday of my life and then I'm gonna make a video of how I'm gonna finish this with my acrylics. Thank you so much for being here. Oh, and I forgot. I have, all of these are my inks. So what I do is I get the small bottle, okay? This is the concentrate. And then I make a mix with alcohol and I put labels of the names. So all of my inks are like that and I think it's very easy for you to keep track. And when you dilute them, you can have like this beautiful soft colors over here. And then if you want to go darker, you can still use your concentrates. You just like go little by little and you can control it better. So that's what I think it is. So I might just do another piece. How's that? Okay. Wait, let's get in position again because this is madness. Being in a small studio is a thing, like a big challenge. Okay, let's put things away. I'm gonna do another one. This one is a 24 by 24. And we're gonna be doing the same thing. I'm gonna use the same color palette because I really like it sure that I have that there. So this is an all canvas. I seal it and make sure that you guys can see very good. It's about to get very noisy over here. Just letting you know, guys. All right, so that is perfect. Welcome, welcome, guys. So I'm gonna use these two colors, the same colors that I used on the other one because I think it's so pretty. It's about to get very noisy here, but Bear with me. So this time I'm going to start with my blue, actually. I'm going to make, actually, no, I like to start with the soft. Okay, so I'm going to do pretty much the same thing. So I'm going to move things around. Maybe I come this way and then I will just come this way. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm going to add my alcohol in here. I'm going to add some of my dilute ink. I'm going to have a little bit of my blue, a little bit of my sangria, a little bit of my black over here. So what I'm doing now is I'm adding the colors and then adding the alcohol. We're gonna play around and see. I don't worry about it. Things are going, it's about, it's about to get very messy in here because I'm very into it, I'm very inspired right now. I don't know why, but something happened. Something happened. Okay, you can see how that gold just blows away. It's a beautiful dusty gold that I love. All right, so I'm just gonna move things around. Okay, and I'm gonna keep using my 
the nice and pink over here because that's what's going to give me a nice beautiful soft look right and then i'm going to keep moving and doing the same thing over and over till i am satisfied you know how it goes i love the combo of my blue and the pink it's just it's just so pretty i also love my magenta i mean my sangria i think it's very pretty as well but I just love how the pink gets mixed with this blue. It just gives you a very soft purple. And it's so pretty. Alright, so now I'm going to just use more of my alcohol. If I have any here. You notice I did not use any of my acrylics today. Like my whites or anything. But I'm going to actually try to see what happened if I put a little bit of my India oh okay but it does just softer your your color palette which is not a problem I like that it's all about playing around with whatever you have at home and see what happens I like to experiment so bear with me I might actually fill up all of this combat instead of like having negative space i'm gonna just fill it all up same as nebuda what's that what's happening <laughs> all right so i'm gonna add a little bit more of this one here because it was a very pretty color this one is pink sherbet I think it's gorgeous. Gorgeous! Gonna add more of this. Gonna add a little bit of my black. Tiny bit because black can be very overpowering. Like it gets a, can just like mess up your softness on your palette. Okay. So I'm gonna keep doing this. Till I am satisfied, I'm moving in circles and see what it gave me, you know, like a very abstract. All right, I need to put more blue. Actually, I might use, I might use a different blue this time. I'm gonna make it a little darker. All right, so let's put a little bit in here. I don't like it, no. It's too bright. I want it softer. So if this happens that you don't want a color, you just come with a paper towel and you wipe it. And then you put the color that you really want and put it right in there and just mix it with more alcohol. I keep rolling. Oh, it's a little bit more darker as how I want it. I'm going to put a little bit more of alcohol in here. Just leave in the comment where are you watching from, guys. Thank you for watching. I and mean, it's having some time, spending time with me on a Sunday. All right, so that's pretty good. Making it. Okay, so I'm gonna use a little bit of my black over here. With a little bit of my, my uh, sangria. I'm gonna move things around this way. I'm gonna have a little bit, a lot of alcohol on this side here. And I'm gonna use more of my blue. I'm gonna move things. Wow, I don't know what I'm doing. Just pushing the ink around and see what I'm gonna get. Alright. There we go. Alright, so let's add more pink up here. Alcohol here. I'm gonna use 
is my server. Gonna get more pink, like a lot of pink. I want the background to be nice and light. So I'm going to move to this corner over here. You guys can see, yeah. I'm going to just move things around a little bit more over here. Just like move it around crazy. Who cares? Because you're going to kind of fix it with your air pump. I'm going to have a little bit of my black in here. And then in there. Just to keep a little bit more of that there. A little bit of my blue right here. I'm gonna add a little bit of my gold in this corner here and in there. Alright, so now I'm gonna just get the big gun here quick. I'm going to get a little bit of the ink out. So now that I have this, I just want to see what it looks like when I put it this way. Right, she's still soft, but I think, I think I might just, let's see, I might either work toward soften this area here and then coming up here a little bit more. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. So I'm just going to keep working on this area here. I'm going to keep using my pink. I keep moving around in this area. I put this in. Um, 
more in here. And then I'm gonna use my pump this time. Okay, I'm gonna use a little bit of my pink circuit. I'm gonna add a little bit of like some texture in here. All right, and then I wanna soft this over here a little bit more. All right, so I think I'm going to move this a little bit over here. Because I saw a few drips from standing it up. So I'm going to make another video. Not of my live one. The one that I like to like upload midweek before my live. Uh, videos and then I'm gonna just do a close-up of everything that we're doing right now Because I think it's pretty cool. It would be nice if you guys can see it like in a very close range But it's, it's, it's hard Anyway, so I'm gonna add a little bit more of pink on this area here and again, I'm gonna just move around The ink just, I'm just right now creating depth, you know, instead of like being just a big chunk of like ink, I get to have more movement. And this type of work, guys, how I mentioned before, it, like it needs unique patience for this, like you want to go slow, you don't want to rush, and, you know, enjoy, because I think it's very relaxing and meditating. I can't believe I give up smoking, that is wild, so you know I make a video about it, I document everything, my first 12 hours of like craving nicotine was intense, but here I am, not craving my smokes, nothing, it has been amazing seven days smoking free and I'm loving it all right so I think I'm going to add a little bit of my blue maybe I wish just like put it over here so I'm going to go very big on this corner here yeah I'm going to go pretty big there before I want to dry it my blue so maybe I should make this blue a little bit more open in here okay let's try that let's see what happens I love to spray man and see what goes what's happening I might add a little bit more of the blue okay and then I want to add pump it just want to make it a little bit wider That's really good. Yeah, and then I'm gonna do the same. I think I'm gonna do more blue in here. I'm gonna add more of my alcohol, you guys can see. Yeah, you guys can see. And then I'm just gonna move it around in here as well. I 
me more alcohol. Give me more alcohol. <laughs> there, I love this. This is what I wanna. This is what I wanna. Alright, so it's looking pretty good. So when I get very close with the nose, it just it helps me to dry the ink faster, but at the same time it's giving me some kind of like movement as well, which is awesome. Alright, so now I come with my big guy. Alright, so let's put that one. On the diesel. So you, you guys can see, come on. Don't embarrass me, easel. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna put this one under. And then, come on over here. My small little. Okay, I'm gonna show you how this one looks. What a mess. When I put it in here. All right, so I kind of like how it turned out. Pretty close to what I wanted, which is very close to this one at the bottom in here. So this one up here, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spray, um, why spray? So I'm gonna use, in my outdoor studio, I'm going to use my white spray paint and I'm gonna spray in areas that I might want the negative space to stay, but I think it's pretty good what I did today. And I am so appreciative for those women who show up today for my life. Every Sunday I'm here and every Sunday I'm gonna be making new paintings and sharing everything with you. Thank you so much and I will see you next Sunday. Remember, I'm gonna load a video of like how I finished these paintings in here, okay? Thank you so much, bye for now.